Good afternoon, Thrivers. This is Jason Camper, one of the founders and CEOs of Lavelle.com and the Thrive Experience. I wanted to come to you with a live audio message uh, during this interesting uh, health challenge the country and the world is facing with this pandemic. You know, one of the positive things that has always been a shining bright light with Lavelle and with the Thrive Experience is our message of hope, our story of solution. You know, whether we're in a health crisis or non-health crisis, the story of Lavelle and the story of the Thrive Experience has never changed. And that story is that uh, within eight years, less than eight years, we have become uh, one of the fastest growing health and wellness movements all across the globe. You guys know the stats. We loudly and proudly and gratefully share them all the time. Over 2 billion in collective sales, over 10 million customers, 26 patents and counting, uh, lots of rewards, lots of magazines, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And, um, you know, that story is still consistent now as it has ever been before. You know, we're, we're in a state right now where people are looking for solutions more than they ever have. You know, we always talk about the New Year's time frame uh, being such a positive and fruit-bearing uh, period of time for Lavelle and for the product line as every American, North American uh, always has two similar New Year's resolutions at that time frame at the beginning of the year. It's around health, better health, and better finances, right? If you were to ask anybody what their New Year's resolutions are, 90% chance they're going to say something around better health, better finances. And right now, when you come into some type of challenging time, uh, whether it be economic challenges, whether it be um, health challenges, such as the challenge that we're seeing right now, those needs for solutions uh, increase 5x, 10x, right? Where people are looking uh, for better health, better finances. And, you know, the Thrive Experience, why that product line and why that story has been one of the most successful nutritional stories in our history of manufacturing and selling nutritional-based supplements in this country's, in this world's history of selling those products, why that story and system has been one of the most paramount stories ever written, ever told, is because of how we approach the conversation of nutritional supplementation. From day one, we wanted to manufacture a formula, manufacture a system that um, approached nutritional deficiencies and why people were having um, physical flaws, if you will, right? Why is somebody not sleeping well? Why is somebody um, having discomforts? Why is somebody not able to manage their weight properly? And instead of just throwing a bunch of ingredients at the topic, right, what, which I would consider to be a Band-Aid type effect, right, uh, let's look at the root cause first and let's look at the nutritional flaws and nutritional deficiencies that the everyday average person has from living a very busy lifestyle, a, micro, a microwave society, not having the proper food, not having the proper nutrition uh, to build the proper body and to build the proper health um, perspective. And so that's what the Thrive Experience was formulated for, to help give the body the proper nutrition it needs to fill in nutritional gaps, to help fill in those nutritional defici deficiencies. And I'm not saying that it is the end-all, be-all, and, and uh, we'll take somebody's nutritional deficiencies and completely uh, rectify them. I'm saying that it helps the subject, right? When you give the body the nutrition that it needs, it's able to run and operate at peak levels that the body's designed to do. The body is an amazing machine. The body can recover at an amazing rate. The body can perform at an amazing rate, but the body has to have the nutrition it needs. It has to have the sleep it needs. It has to have the hydration it needs. There's a lot of variables to building the perfect body, the premium lifestyle, the premium uh, healthy man or woman, right? We all know that. And, that, and in this time, of uh, a health situation in our country and in our 
globe, there has never uh, been more of a need, right, for proper nutrition. And you got to be very careful, right, because in no way would we ever claim that our products can prevent some type of, of illness, right? That That's not something we even want to allude to. That That's what um, a shady, what I would consider kind of shady marketing tactics. That's not who we are. That's never who we've been about. We've always been very upfront uh, and very, very matter of fact uh, of what our products are, how we represent them and uh, what they are intended to do, right? And we are a nutritional based supplement company and what our products are intended to do is help from a nutritional perspective, right? And as, and as giving the body more nutrients, more of the nutritional content that it's not getting, that it does need from the foods that we eat, right? Uh, as a result, uh, you're going to have better physical results day to day, whether that be better energy, better weight management, better, uh, you know, improved immune system, improve this, improve that, right? It's not the end all be all to fix, cure, or prevent anything, all right? Uh, we can't fix, prevent, or cure anything, right? That's not what we're doing. But if you can provide a solution to what people are looking for, then it makes logical sense for a consumer to partake, right? If you're, if you're constantly selling something to someone that they're not looking for, right? If you're selling something based on facts or this or that that they're not looking for or not interested in, it's, it's kind of a hard sell. But if you can always match up a solution to someone for what they're looking for, um, then it's not really a sell. It's, it's almost like you're a consultant and you brought a solution to the table for what they're looking for. So I just wanted to reach out and communicate with everybody. I also want to say congratulations and great job uh, to the leadership in this uh, movement, in this uh, Thrive Tribe, as I would call it. You know, what we have seen over the last week uh, where, you know, a lot of the country has kind of... Uh, panicked in some form or fashion and, and, and partly for good reason, right? This is kind of a, a rarity in our time, certainly nothing I've seen in my life and likely nothing you've seen in your lifetime. But, you know, life goes on, right? This too shall pass. And uh, history has shown us that, that, you know, it doesn't rain forever. The sun does come back out and, and uh, this too shall pass. But, but what a resilient group of leaders that we have that I've seen that, um, you know, have, have brought and fought for solution based activities. I mean, I, I just smile when I'm thinking in my head of some of the leaders that in particular, what they have done over the last week is news has spread of, um, this health challenge that we're facing and how we cannot, you know, have our locals and have groups of certain number of people and how that is, prohibited travel and things of that nature that is a lot uh, that has a lot to do with our business and how we communicate with the end consumer and customers and build our team of customers and we like to go see them we travel we do those things and and right now the solution based activities that I'm seeing in the field with these leaders where they're doing uh, planning a lot of virtual locals uh, whether it be over the phone or whether it be through a Zoom or whether it be through a Facebook or excuse me, yeah, Facebook or YouTube Live. And, and you know, just the, just the locking arms virtually right now and uh, saying, guys, life goes on. There's people getting up every day now more than ever uh, that are looking to, you know, uh, build their body from a physical perspective. There's people now more than ever that are looking um, for um, you know financial solutions here or there to uh, help you know meet the needs at the end of the day and um, you know whatever challenges any family may be facing they may have to do with what we can provide a solution and they they may not but um, you know since 2012 we've told a story of the Thrive experience and that product line and and what that story means and what that story involves. And um, it's just led to a gratifying result uh, here in 2020 
eight years later. And uh, that story continues to be waved. That flag is very high in the air right now. And our plans uh, that we are doing from a virtual perspective right now uh, to continue with our Thrive Palooza events and plans, the innovations and product offerings that we've been uh, working very diligently on over the last several months, uh, those have not stopped in any form and fashion. Better yet, we're looking to improve timelines. Um, we're steadily uh, focusing on our shipping um, executions right now that that you know that ensure that we maintain uh, flawless execution. You know everything that we're doing from a corporate perspective right now is uh, we are firing all cylinders uh, as hard and fast as we can fire them. And um, the, you know, an interesting side note here, you know, this health challenge um, has been eye-opening for us corporately. We're, we're now looking into um, things that we can do over and above uh, what we're currently doing right now from a company perspective, from a product line offering perspective. And we're seeing that, wow, um, you know, we think that we can make a bigger impact than what we're currently doing right now with this challenge, uh, this health challenge and what's going on. And I won't go too deep into that right now because it's very preliminary, but I just wanted to let you know, make no mistake about it. Uh, this time frame for us doesn't mean, you know, sitting, twiddling our thumbs. Um, it, it's, it's, it's actually caused the creativity and the brainstorming to go to another level and in another direction than we were currently thinking, right? You know, life as we kind of know it right now uh, has evolved and I think will continue to evolve. These are new days and new times that a lot of us have not seen. And um, as a result, it may result in a, a new lifestyle uh, going forward. You know, even, even when this storm clears and, and things are back to quote unquote status quo, uh, we may find ourselves kind of living a uh, little different lifestyles and little different daily regimens, habitual practices, et cetera. And, um, you know, we're, we, we feel that we can capitalize on that in a very, very positive uh, manner. So hope you guys are doing well. Hope your families are safe and uh, hope you are maintaining a smile at the, at the end of the day with this and a positive demeanor. Um, you know, there's, there's a lot of emails going on right now. There's a lot of this being said and that being said on the news and, and you, you, you'll, you will not uh, be hard pressed at all to find that type of information that some people may find, uh, educating or negative, you know, based on the person. But there's one thing that we all can control at the end of the day. And is as challenging as it may be sometimes, uh, for our families, that positive, grateful, attitude uh, sure does go a long way for me. I mean, I, I go to bed every night thinking what I'm grateful for, uh, mentally saying what I'm grateful for, and I, I wake up thinking about those things. And it's, uh, it's, it's hard to not be in a positive outlook when you're simply grateful for what you have. And uh, just remember, we're excited. We're ready to uh, show the world kind of what we've been working on these last few months. We're ready to to keep telling the story from a global perspective and uh, we're more excited than ever as we you know as this storm passes over the next 30 or 60 days whatever the case may be and uh you know the, the sun we feel like is going to come out brighter than it ever has shined before for labelle.com and the thrive experience once again though uh, this was a message just simply reaching out trying to say hello trying to connect with each of you um, I know my co-CEO Paul Gravett is doing the same, President Drew Hoffman is, is doing the same, and anybody listening to this message that considers themselves a leader with this company, I sure, have no doubt you are doing the same, right? You're making virtual contact with a lot of people right now and uh, you know, letting them know that, hey, this, this company, Lavelle.com, um, this train is still going as fast and hard as ever. And, and thank the Lord that it is a, so, a solution for us to be able to um, work virtually, right? You know, many of the people that are facing this health challenge do not have that luxury and it's put them 
in a um, compounded challenge, right? And, and that's not the case for us. And so we're very grateful and thankful. And once again, congratulations to the field leaders that have been working on solution-based activities to do what we've been doing since 2012. And that's very simply hashtag get people on thrive G P O T and the hashtag leadership blitz has certainly not stopped and it's still going very vigorously. So get ready for some exciting updates coming down the pipe from us uh, about some of these new um, game changing technologies and um, delivery systems and patent pending concepts that we have up our sleeve that were set to be released at Thrive Palooza, and that has not changed at all. It's actually uh, looks like timelines are improving on that. I uh, just want to recap that note and then be, li be looking at and listening to hear from us about the virtual uh, Palooza that we plan on doing. And, and uh, just, just note that every day uh, things change, right, with, with um, how we travel and how we do things, and we're always going to look to improve on the situation as uh, things continue to improve out there. So with that being said, thank you for listening to uh, a longer audio message that I had intended, but I, I did want to reach out and connect with as many people as I can. And um, I know I've uh, been asked to be on several virtual locals lately, and I look forward to making my presence and being a part on, on many of those. So have a good day. God bless. Thrive on. And uh, remember, this too shall pass. Bye-bye.